um, about this film uh, i think it's an extremely important film because it shows what the victim goes through when the act is happening and just how much a person breaks psychologically and goes to a point where they give up and say do whatever you want with me but just leave me here because they don't want to die it's a life threatening situation and i cannot even imagine what happens when somebody is really in a situation like that because i felt that through this film and to this day i haven't forgotten the impact that it has left on me uh, while i was shooting for this film uh, or a rumba challenging time for me to come out of the film also it took me a few months to fully forget all the pain that it it had caused i knew i was acting but after 2 3 days i started forgetting who i was and i just became the girl who is kidnapped and and is trapped in the car amidst all these all these people and for the rest uh, thank you so much her sir for the opportunity um, he did not even take my audition for this film about which i am very shocked because uh, usually you know everybody likes to take an audition and go ahead but he said no i want you and he was very set uh in in terms of having me so i'm very grateful that he had that faith in me in return it also helped me have a lot of faith in him and he has delivered and how i think he is an amazing director and i had a great time working with you sir thank you so much to the rest of the cast and crew thank you so much for being so supportive on set and my one and only wish uh, in the padathala is that i hope that it finds its audience and makes the kind of impact that we are hoping that it does thank you so much ஹிருத்திகா சிங்கிட்ட கொஸ்டின் கேட்குறவங்க கேட்கலாம் ஃபஸ்ட்டு நான் ஸ்டார்ட் பண்ணி வைக்கிறேன் இறுதி சுற்று ஆண்டவன் கட்டளை சிவலிங்கா ஓமை கடவுளைக்கு அப்புறம் இந்த படத்தில் நடிச்சிருக்கீங்க ஒய்வ் ஆர் நாட் சூஸிங் மெனி ஃபிலிம்ஸ் ஏன் நிறைய தமிழ் படங்களை நீங்கள் நடிக்கிறது இல்லை நோ எனக்கு நிறைய ஆசை இருக்கு தமிழ் படம் பண்ணணும் சத்தியமா சொல்றேன் ஆனா நான் கொஞ்சம் எனக்கு தெரியாது to the final destination so i am i would love to do tamil films na ipo nalla tamil pesre kathikire slowly slowly enaku full flow la one day i want to speak tamil and that's my goal for now so as in when the right script comes i'll definitely do more of them all the best thank you um i would love to do comedy Uh, I think I think I'd be very I'll fit there because I'm a very goofy person naturally and I have a lot of this energy and I feel like a comedy film will utilize it really well uh, also an action film with guns and cars and bikes I think it will be great something like a fast and furious or a wonder woman so off the bat I can think of those kind of films we are give up uh, uh, you can do it uh, many how many times in uh, but inside the car yes why you uh, accept as a woman Oh, why are give up ah, okay he's saying why did i accept that ah because uh, yeah i'll i'll just uh, hand it to her in the story it is set up uh, that if if they take her out of the car she is 100% dead so and because she has heard this she has they, she has lost all hope and she's scared so that's why she makes that that dialogue comes because of that director sir adhe mari or question neenga vande pesra pe sonninga indha mari india pathi malai nadu la vera mari nanjittirukanga foreign countries la la amma la illa or transfer pannu neenga vande transfer pannu avaru ivaru malai nadu la nammala pathi elder ku mariyada kudukrama appadina nanjittirukanga ஆனா இங்க எப்படி நடக்குதுன்னு படம் எடுத்திருக்கீங்க ஏற்கனவே ஒரு சம்பவம் நடக்கிறது படமா பிடிக்கிறது நமக்கு பிளஸ்ஸா மைனஸ் இந்தியன்ஸுக்கு ஆக்சுவலி ட்ரெடிஷனல் அண்ட் வெல் பிகேவியர் பட் இஃப் யூ ஆர் மேக்கிங் ஃபிலிம் லைக் தட் வாட் தே வில் திங்க் அபவுட் அவர் ட்ரெடிஷனல் எவ்ரி திங் ஆல்ரெடி தே சூஸ் வி ஆர் அரோகண்ட் லைக் தட் ஸோ இஃப் யூ போர்ட்ரேட் லைக் தட் இந்தியன்ஸ் how the foreigners will treat like any any one incidents happening anywhere so if you are mainly focus on that it will portray widely in foreign yeah. countries that's that's a good question 
let me answer this uh, because uh, this question has been asked to me before about this film uh, and the answer is this uh, good things are happening in our country really good things are happening and all over the country they are happening you know and uh, we are all proud I am also very proud uh, but at the same time we cannot ignore see this is our country this is our country good, bad, ugly we are the only ones who are making it good, bad and the ugly you know when you go to the doctor you don't say my hand is fine check the hand you tell them whichever area is hurting which needs attention so we are coming from that place and this is this is basic human right it's not a question of women men sexual molestation this is a question of basic human right can you imagine if you don't have control just think for one second if you don't have 100% control of your own body we, we can't even imagine because it hasn't happened to us when somebody snatches such a big part of us uh, that's something which needs addressed you know uh, and it's I don't think we need to be uh, ashamed of it or anything this these things happen in all countries unfortunately worst thing happen actually you know so we should not be ashamed it is addressed in a way uh, where you know it, it can sort of bring us together in a collective consciousness and maybe try to find a solution you know that is the hope yeah. Uh, no. Uh, and I'll tell you why. Because, like I said, uh, this uh, this film doesn't take sides. It doesn't say men are bad. All men are bad. It doesn't even say men should not do this. Or women should do this to avoid that. It doesn't. It will simply show you in very raw, in a very everyday language. It's a universal story and that is why the producers, Mr. Sajid Qureshi, he has backed me so much that he said, we'll, it's a universal story. There is a, koi bhi language mein shoot kiya ho. it will appeal and it will connect to people all over the country. You know, the solution is very complex. The solution, I am not an activist, I am not a psychologist, I am an artist, I am a filmmaker. Uh, so I do not pretend to, you know, provide or say that I have a solution. It's a complex solution. It needs education. It needs, uh, you know, the home culture, Sanskriti, John Bolte, like upbringing. It needs uh, environment where men grow up. If they grow up listening to their elders talking about women like that, naturally they'll also they'll think this is normal. This is how they'll grow up, you know. So that's the thing. So what was the delay in getting the release of the movie? Actually, it was done in the uh, in 2018, 2019, isn't it? Uh, actually, the delay was for a couple of reasons. Uh, one was uh, we had a little tussle with uh, CBFC. Uh, and you had to change the title also, isn't it? Earlier you had something else. Yes, we did. Yes, uh, we did, and I'm glad that we have this title now. Uh, because it, it, it tells you exactly what the film is and in Hindi it also means no, in car means no, you know. And then the lockdown happened and then I recite on the edit uh, uh, and I thought uh, the sen sensibilities of audience have changed a little bit after the pandemic so I tightened it a little bit. Yeah. You had any uh, separate kind of photography in it? A different? Here, different here. Yeah. Different you kind of Yeah, you had uh, um, tried some uh, new technique in the photography. Is it true? It's not really a new technique. Anamorphic. We yeah. shot uh, in with anamorphic lenses, which are, <laughs> which is what the American westerns are shot. Uh, used to be shot. Or what Shole, you know, that they used to call it cinema scope then. Uh, so what happens when the technically, I'm sorry I won't bore you guys too much, but technically what happens if the camera is too close uh, like it was in the car, 
it cannot cover five people and also show you background. So you need a wider lens. So, uh, so we used <coughs> anamorphic camera uh, with anamorphic lenses and we use multiple cameras. Uh, we also use some um, American techniques. Uh, some of it I wanted to cut the roof of the car and drop the camera so it can move 360 degrees inside. Uh, uh, so yeah, technically we did everything. This is not this is not a small film like that. I mean, we shot over 32 days on location inside actual moving car. We could have done this with green screen. Uh, we didn't do it. We went on the location. We uh, did it. The, the BGM is done from France, uh, you know, with uh, Matthias Duplessy. And uh, so it's a properly mounted film and, and it, it has optimum budget. Uh, but yeah, technically we played a lot with it. Oh, thank you. 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 I will personally go and give them punishment. I cannot stand it. It absolutely breaks my heart. Every time I open my Twitter, every time I go to my Twitter home, I think there are at least five, six news articles that I see. Eight month old baby, three months old baby. Like people are absolutely <coughs> merciless and ruthless and they deserve the exact same treatment in return. It absolutely boils my blood like I, I I could not even come up with an answer to this because it makes me very angry that people think that we are all toys for their pleasure you know and this happens to men women all kinds of people it's just that men I'm glad that now they have a platform slowly people are starting to come forward and speak their truth their truth but it happens more often than we know of and uh, I mean, I, I don't think any punishment is enough for such people. <laughs> yeah, but it is, uh, I'm not sure why it's not there, uh, but it has been passed by censor, otherwise you can't show it. <laughs> Yeah, that's why I'm saying I'm not sure why it's not attached to this, but it has been obviously certified. Right. I, un I understand you are saying it should be attached to it, I agree. I'm not sure why it is not uh, attached to it. Sensor has been done for the trailer, yes. For all languages. A rating. Actually, we are not here this type of style in Tamil films, first time. So don't do to me, uh, don't push me to this. And, but she is telling that uh, you can uh, utilize me how many times and like that. Why should it be in this? Because it's a trailer. <laughs> it's not the entire film. The film is 100 minutes. The tra uh, trailer is 2 minutes. So I have to show the landscape of the trailer, right? Of the story in the trailer. So you can imagine, see the trailer takes you from point, point A to point B because she's she has been shown, she has been kidnapped and to what extent psychologically she has been destroyed. I imagine for any women, it yeah, applies to men also, but in this case, for any women to say that to strangers, it's, it's, uh, that itself is uh, heartbreaking, you know. Director, sir, you are an artist or a filmmaker. You are also an artist. Me? Yeah. I am an artist uh, behind the camera. <laughs> Not. Okay, okay. This is the first time I am in front of cameras. The driver, driver, car interest in the car driver, the car driver, 
அவங்க மூணு பேர் பண்றது மேல இன்ட்ரஸ்ட் இல்ல மாதிரி தெரியுது அப்புறம் ஏன் அவர் கார் ஓட்டிட்டு வராரு எவ்ரி திங் இஸ் இன் திம் Everything Everything is in the the film. I'm, I'm happy that 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 you're asking me this question because that means the trailer works. You want to know more. Ritika, finally your question. Say, For... I I spoke to uh, I spoke to a lawyer who rep- represented two of uh, no, not the Delhi case something which happened in Mumbai equally horrendous different incident this film is not uh, inspired by a single incident it's inspired by multiple incidences i spoke to a lawyer uh, similar similar thing happened in mumbai uh, few 6 7 years back where this they, a girl was taken into a, a ruins you know the old buildings which are abandoned she was taken over there and uh, it was horrible they made a video and all that uh <clears throat> so i spoke to the lawyer and they were uh, from that i got a lot of insight you know <laughs> yeah yeah it says inspired by true incidents no that that triggered me uh, to write the script that start started me why 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 would anyone make a film like this <clears throat> to make a film like this you need a very strong reason i i in my own family there have been uh, uh, i won't go into details but there have been um, you know victims of such this thing um but that incident really shook me and uh, that uh, it, that made me want to do something and because i have very limited skills i'm just a writer director so this is all i could do you know ya ninge vandu or national winner artist indha padathukku ungalku edhavadhu awards kadaikana number illa adu theriyadu i'm just hoping in the padam can find its audience like i said adhu illa na yosile yosike illa but let's see director sir in uh, rithika speech in rithika speech she told uh, she is not have a audition directly on to the board why you asking me all my secrets <laughs> um actually uh, i uh, we had been considering few options uh, for her role uh, when um, actually mr sajid kureshi uh, the producer of the film he suggested her name uh, so i had seen sala khadus by then and i had really liked the film uh, but she was in a very different role in that so i sent her the script uh, ahead of time and I, she was shooting in bangalore so i came from mumbai to bangalore to meet her and when i met her the first time she asked me all the correct questions about the script uh which uh, basically means she pointed out sir uh, in this situation a girl will not act like this or a girl will not say like this you know uh, that means she had given it a lot of thought not just like a role you know whether i should do this role or not the other factor was i really wanted uh, somebody who who is not a complete fresher but also somebody who will trust me because i am also i was a first time director so i wanted somebody who will like completely trust me uh, in to what i was trying to achieve and so when she started asking me this question i realized that she she got really the story really touched her and later on i came to know she is very passionate about uh, self defense she in fact you teach she teaches she does workshops in uh, colleges and all that for young uh, girls and women uh, in self defense 
so this couple of factors uh, added with uh, uh, you know her enthusiasm for the role i mean sir this is an important film we should do this just the way you have written we should do this we should not compromise which helped me a lot to go back to my producer and say sir it's not just me who is saying we should make it just like this she also feels and then the other people came on the board and they all supported that if we make this film it has to be made like this with this kind of language which is a very risky thing to do you know uh, but we got a lot of backing uh, from inbox pictures and that's why he he, he uh, there was a discussion to shoot it outside are it's only highway you don't know which highway it is shoot it outside mumbai on highway so i said no i said i need the weather i need i need uh, my artist in that mentality when you are on location you know uh, the artists are also trapped uh, because then then they cannot go home there is no change of uh, pace you know so that helped and she has really delivered if there is justice she should she should get another national award for this i, I personally feel <laughs> நான் <laughs> 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 sir i'll show you a message okay now i'm going to speak the truth my team told me na the satyam has told i'll show you a message we were supposed to be here at 9 pm na hotel keeler he'll say i was there at 8:50 i was here around 9:05 i was here on time because we were given 9 pm for chennai express meet i would never ever do this i reached my hotel at 7:15 pm your your time is 9 pm yeah they told me 9 pm already you told me 6 pm now it yenakku theriyadu i'll show you messages in my phone i have proof i will not lie like this sorry okay pa confusion okay i am genuinely sorry it is i mean it's it's their fault because they miscommunicated and i am to take blame for this and i don't like this because i respect you guys a lot you put in so much effort you put in so much time to do this for us so i am genuinely from the bottom of my heart sorry extremely sorry but this happened because of a very severe miscommunication and before i even got on stage i was extremely angry i told my team i said this is not done this is inefficiency on your part and i will look bad in front of the press so i am genuinely manichidunga this will never happen again i will henceforth i'll be extra careful and ask my team 10 times what is the what is the correct time to be there because i was told umbod maniki and i was there at at the right time so i'm i'm very sorry according to what time they gave me i was here but because of this honest miscommunication i'm genuinely sorry i truly apologize thank you